I've said this before, I will say it again, I will always say this, all disease is diet related. There are absolutely zero exceptions to this. No disease is genetic. No disease is, has anything to do with your DNA. No disease is hereditary, passed down from so-and-so, and it just runs in. That's all bullshit. All disease is diet related and all disease is the result of bodily poisoning, period. And when I say diet related, by diet, what I mean is whatever you allow in your body. It doesn't necessarily refer to what you eat, although that would be the number one cause. It also refers to what you drink. It also refers to when you allow somebody to inject some shit into your veins, straight into your bloodstream. You don't even know what the fuck it is. You don't even fucking ask. You know, it could also be caused by shit that you put on your skin that you don't even take the time to read the fucking labels. But if you were to take the time to read the labels on those fucking lotions and body oils and all that shit that you put on your skin, you would find out that all that shit is toxic. All that shit is poisonous. It all causes disease. And what you put on your skin is absorbed into your bloodstream. And your blood is the food for your body. It's the blood that feeds every single cell in the body. So whatever your blood is made of, this is what your cells are eating. So if your blood is made of toxins, and poisons, then your cells, trillions of cells that make up your body is eating toxins and poisons. It's as simple as that. So now with that being said, cardiovascular disease is the number one cause of death in the world. Almost 18 million people die from cardiovascular, some sort of cardiovascular disease every single year. Can you name one person that died from cardiovascular disease that ate nothing but fruit? I got time. You could DM me. Cancer is the number two cause of death worldwide. Can you name one person that's died of any form of cancer from eating nothing but fruit? You can't do it. Please don't name Steve Jobs. Please, please learn what the fuck you're talking about first. Like you should research the shit that you say before you say it, just to make sure. Like, let me make sure that this shit is right before I just carelessly speak that shit out. If you had that much integrity, fruit did not give Steve Jobs pancreatic cancer. Eating the flesh of dead animals is linked to pancreatic cancer. And Steve Jobs, he was not a fruitarian. Steve Jobs flip-flopped. He went back and forth. He went through phases. So he would go through a phase where he was just eating fruit heavily, and then he would go through a phase when he wasn't. He would go back and forth. He would flip-flop. Steve Jobs didn't eat nothing but fruit. Diabetes is fourth. Dementia is fifth. Lower Lord. respiratory infections is sixth. And you got neonatal deaths, you got diarrheal diseases, you got liver disease, tuberculosis, kidney disease, digestive disease, Parkinson's, on and on and on and on it goes. Can you name one person that's died from consuming an all fruit diet? That's the question. Whatever the disease, even if it's something I didn't mention, you can't because fruit doesn't cause disease. Fruit helps you heal from disease. Fruit removes disease from the body. Fruit helps the cells heal. Fruit doesn't make the cells sick. This is not poison right here. This is the food that God gave us to eat. This was produced in nature. The shit that y'all eat don't grow in nature. 
You can't find that shit growing on a tree, on a bush, or out the ground, or on a vine. You can't find that shit anywhere. If you want to find the shit that you eat, you got to go to a fucking laboratory. You got to talk to some scientists. You got to go to a fucking factory. Because everything you eat is man-made and mass-produced by men. You're eating inventions of other men. What you're eating has patents on it. You're not eating the creations of God. You're eating the creations of men. And everything man makes causes disease. Man can't outdo God. You fucking crazy? There is nothing that man can make for you to eat that will be better than what God made for you to eat. Like, are you fucking stupid? You got to be stupid to believe that. The creation will never be able to outdo the creator. It's common sense, period. And so what y'all do is ignore the creator of man and you run to the creation, which is man. And you worship the creation like the creation is God. And you ignore the creator, which is actually God. And that's y'all confusion. That's where y'all get it fucked up. And so you'd rather eat something that was made by a man than eating something that grew naturally on a tree or out the ground. You would rather eat something that was produced on some motherfucking machinery in a factory rather than go out in nature and pick something off a tree off a bush, out off a vine, or pick it out the ground. You're lost.